I just do it because you know. I think you just. I'm a sloppy player, so. <laughs> you just have to pass the line it up, yeah. Barely. Is it is it something wrong with the server or? Are you having issues? I got a froze. I yeah, but a freeze yeah, I don't know. I saw but it, but it wasn't. I I didn't have it. I just saw yours. Yeah, I was able to alt tab out. Oh right. Button. I don't think it was my PC at least. No. So I think this is PC. from. Is it from CPM three? From above. above oh wow! The armor yeah. Armor to I think it is. Rocket launcher. Oh yeah, it is. Yes. But I think it's a little bit harder in CPM three, and there's the map bug in CPM three. Oh right yeah. Here. You know the map bug? You get stuck, right? You get like. Yeah, there's like a clip edge over it'll here. It'll just stop your momentum. Or make you fall down like a cripply clip? Uh, no, it's actually a horizontal clip plane. Oh, so you okay. Sort of, so you sort of you can land on the edge. Oh, okay. Edge of the wall there. And this is from TM3. TM6. I mean, six. TM6. <laughs> yeah. I think most people know this jump. Whoa, first try. I tried it early. I couldn't do it. So I'm gonna show. I need to heighten my sensitivity a little bit. Yeah. I'm okay. gonna show my. Favorite trick. Favorite trick. <laughs> if I can make it. Oh, you're using. Are you using the little edge there? Oh, wow, okay. Wow, alright, that is. That is pretty nice to watch. And wait, there's more. <laughs> if, if I can do it. And for for this trick, I think I need to thank either Ovo or Haxnax. I'm not sure which one. One of them. One of them. That is that is some next levels. Oh, so you go back, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's it's in one of my movies. I'm not sure which one. I do the. In DM6, I did right. like four or five times, I think. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, not getting it right now. I think people will be impressed by just the one, to be honest. Ah. Oh. And you can also do it from that one. Oh, because okay. Because you get so much distance if you do this one right. No, I'm, I'm not kidding. One more try. Ah, okay, one more. <laughs> <laughs> you go for it, man. Oh, oh nice! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Okay, so uh, this one is nothing but a normal circle jump. You just have to. The problem is that there's these pillars over yep. here. They're even oh. bigger in the the actual map. So you have to the the way I do it is, I do a solo jump a, lit, a little to the left and then turn my yep. air acceleration direction. Yeah. Which means you turn the key that you press and your view. Yeah, I swap my straight to the right and do the um, turn my air acceleration direction yeah. to the right side of the direction of momentum. And I think we should link the. Um, the ET video I showed you. Oh, definitely. For people uh, who I'll, I'll who let me see if I can still find it. Uh, do you have it? No, I don't have it. I have link. it. I have it. I can link it. Okay. Can I link on the Twitch In the screen? chat? Yeah. yeah, if you're in the chat, you can do it. There you go. Okay. Are you back on me? Yes. So, next next <coughs> is teleporter jumps. And we already went through this in the uh, one of the sections. Where you just jump before you go in one. the teleport. Yeah. So you jump before you go in. And then you just do a circle jump. It's 
It's and this is dense. different from uh, Defrag, for instance. Yeah, I think. Because they changed mistake. they changed it in CPM to actually be just a circle jump with added like bonus, while in Defrag it's still. You can't do the same circle jump motion after you come out to get the speed. You have to do yeah. it a little different. Yeah, I think the tele out speed is different in Yes. Death. And there's also the ground boost thingy that gives you crazy speed. I'm not exactly sure how you even do it because I don't play play defrag, but it's not that different. But you can tell. It's just a bit of timing that's different, I think. That's all it is. And maybe mouse movement that it's not as... Because here you just do a circle jump. Yeah. So... I don't... I'm not sure if people have problems with the tele, tele jumps. The concept is really simple, so... Once you realize that you just have to jump as you go in... And then circle then jump circle. on the way, yeah. And, and one of the key issues is that the closer you jump the tele, the more time you have to do the circle jump, because it's 400 milliseconds from the first jump, not from coming out of the teleport. So if you jump from here, you have less time to do a circle jump. Yep. So if you jump just as you go in, you, you have, have the more most time. time. To... So you can move, you have more time to move your mouse in the, in the direction. Yeah, and because the, um, the optimum ground turning speed is not that fast, you, you need enough speed to get the maximum speed up. Yeah. I mean, you, you need enough, enough time to do the maximum turn speed. So yeah, here is... Stair jumps. Stair jumps. And this, I think... Which one is this? This one is... It's been featured more than once, I don't know. Yeah, Isn't this it, is the... Uh, Hmm. No, that is 3A, isn't it? No, it isn't. No, the Mega is across. Yeah, across. it's... Uh... So anyways, let me Some go map. through the stair jump basics. So what you do here is, this is entirely, entirely based on the step-up system where you want to clip, clip one of these steps which causes you to stick to the stairs with, when you jump. And in order to do that more reliably, you want to do a circle jump up the stairs, which gives you more speed, which causes your jump angle to be lower. Like, if you're going slower, your jump angle will be steeper. Yeah, and you'll just jump over the stairs yeah. instead of clipping them. Since they're so small, you have to have a bit of speed yeah. to clip so them if, properly. If you have a lot of speed, your jump angle is lower, so you're more likely to grab one of the steps. So you should always do a circle jump up the stairs when you when you're trying to do the step up. And after that, you just do a normal circle jump. There's nothing more to it. Yep. And here, I think this is CPM that is CPM 22. 22, yeah. But I think this. It's this one is higher than the yes, normal. Yes, it is a bit higher. But but it is closer, I think. Maybe is it? Because oh no, it's further away. I'm not sure. I, I I'm not sure either. But, but it's supposed to be CPM 22. Yeah. So in here, it's very useful to use the um, wall strafe because you can easily get the the speed up. Yeah. You can get the step up more reliably. But you can also do it with a, a circle jump. And in here you can also get oh, yeah. that edge. Oh yeah, that's what I usually do. <laughs> but it's sometimes, sometimes yep. difficult. And here, I have no idea where this is from. Do you know? Oh, no, I don't know. I don't know it by heart, but uh, I mean, why does it have a kind of ledge like that? And there, I only play CPM twenty one, so <laughs> 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 I don't know the other maps. <laughs> I couldn't tell you right now. I'm sure it's from something. But yeah, here 
the concept is always the same in stair jump. You just you want to get the step up. Oh, it's DM6. Is it? What? Oh, the further away, I think. It's the delay, because it couldn't be. DM6 doesn't have. Oh, that does have stairs. But is it but these? But where would it be? But would it, would it be the rail gap? If you do the stair. But oh, yeah, maybe. But it, but it's just it's repurposed, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, a little bit. The, the stairs and closer to the edge. Yeah. DM3, 6, I mean. But yeah. So it's always the same thing. You want to get the step up from the stairs and then a circle jump. In this, in this last jump, I usually use wall. A bit of wall boost. Because I'm lazy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I do. Yeah, it's just. You just need to get used to your tactic. It doesn't really matter how you do it. No, as long as you get there, you could invent something new if there was. Yeah. Okay, so. Should we start off from this where we left off? Yeah. Let's go with that. So this is. Again, just a step up jump, or you can do. a servo jump to a normal double yep. jump. But you don't do a step up. And. Here you either do a stair jump or Double. a step up jump from yeah. here. There are a few, few different ways. And here I think this is meant to be done with two, two jumps. Yeah, I've never done it with one because I'm not you. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is a really good um, benchmark for circle jumps. If you can do this with a single jump, you've done a. A really good circle jump. Yeah. This is pretty close to the m maximum. I think so, yeah. My right circle is so much worse. <laughs> it's the same for me, I don't know why. That is the same for me, I can't do that reliably. The other one is way better. Going lefty. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can see it there! Now I need to do it to the right. Go for it. There we go. Okay, and this is just a ramp. Yep. I, I don't think you can do it without... I use without wa the, wall, the wall speed again. Yep. Because <laughs> I'm just cheap, I don't need to move any, any more than I do. Than I so have yeah, to. this is nothing... Nothing but... This is a pretty... Nice jump though to... I, I like that concept. Because yeah, you have to go around. Yeah, you need speed, you need double jump, and then exactly. you need air turning. Yeah, so. it's a pretty complete jump and it's not too hard, so it makes you feel good. Yeah, so it's a complicated jump, but an easy one, so to speak. No, we can't show the key presses... <coughs> the key presses in... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> sorry. In... Uh, CPMA because it doesn't have that feature. Yeah, that's that's a big shame. It's but one of the uh, features in Defrag, but then the problem with playing in Defrag is that your jump height will be different, so you won't learn for CPMA properly. Because the jumps yeah. are easier. Yeah, even though the differences are really small, I think it just. Yeah, but they, like yeah. they multiply. Everything you do is then multiplied by what you already did, so. Yeah, it just makes more sense to do this map, especially in CPMA, yeah. because yes. it was designed designed for all the things. all the the heights, all the length, all of it is made for CPMA. So in Defrag, it is quite a bit easier <laughs> to do most of these jumps. Yeah, if not all of them. So here is nothing but a circle jump at that ledge, and getting a double from it, and then turning to the left. It's all about. I also do this with Airmen. wall. <laughs> you really? Yeah. No, not like on that. that. No, on I go on the on the side of it. Yeah, oh, and like then just this. yeah. <laughs> That's the one I do. <laughs> I've never done it like that. <laughs> <laughs> so, so here you have two different stars to do this. You either go to the side yep. and continue from there, or you do a 
a bigger jump directly, or you do two directly jumps. across. 